Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Me escucha. Sí, mis. Okay, my friends, we're gonna start here. Let me see. Good evening for everybody. And uh, let me check who is here in this moment. I have Consuelo, Christian, Damaris, Edith, Lorena. Nadia de Los Angeles, Roxana Guadalupe, Veronica Maricela, okay. Okay, very good. Okay, before we start here, I'm going to take your attendance list and just say present, please. So it says Araceli Esmeralda Lopez Garcia. No yet. Carlos Arturo Olmedo Magaña. Okay. Consuelo del Rosario Alemán Gómez. Thank you, Consuelo. Chris and Daniel Alvarado Briseño. I'm here. Okay, very good. Let's see. Eh, Damaris Leticia Garcia. Present. Okay, very good. Edith Lorena Herrera. Present. Thank you. Fatima Yesenia Araujo. Fátima, no. En Fernando de Jesús Morales Enrique. Ibis Arely Torres. Joaquín Jesús Galán. Jorge Eric Ramírez. Present teacher. Ok, thank you. Juan Antonio Villatoro Torres. Juan Antonio, no. Carla Susena Galeas. Carla Susena. Catherine Rebeca Rosales. Lenin Monterrosa Delgado. Eh, Luz Margel García Reyes. Present. Thank you, Luz. María de los Ángeles Jiménez Morales. Present, mm. teacher. Thank you. Then I have Mauricio Alberto Jiménez Majano. Present, Miss. Okay, thank you. Miguel Antonio Abrego Hernández. Present. 
Okay. Uh, Naomi Nicole, there is Asensio. Uh, Oscar is Mesa Leiva. Roxana Guadalupe Duarte Garcia. Present. Okay, thank you. Sandra Margarita Martinez. No. Eh, Verónica Maricela Alegría. Present. Okay, Verónica, thank you. Jensi Alexandra Rodríguez. Jensi. Yes or no? Okay. So now we're gonna continue with your class. And here in the message, this is Maria de Los Angeles. Okay. Fernando, okay. Present. Okay, okay. Thank you. Now, so yesterday we started uh, studying about simple past tense. And today we're gonna continue doing so, practicing simple past tense, okay? So in the first example, I'm gonna show you here. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Tell me, Sandra. Sí, me acabo de conectar. Ah, okay, Sandra Margarita, right? Sí, Martina. Sandra Margarita. Okay, very good. Thank you, Sandra. So now we're gonna practice the sim this simple past tense activities. Uh, and the question is, what did you do yesterday? That's the question. That's the question. What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? I brushed my teeth. What did you do yesterday? I ate breakfast. What did you do yesterday? I went to school. What did you do yesterday? I ate lunch. What did you do yesterday? I read a book. What did you do yesterday? I walked the dog. What did you do yesterday? I drank some water. What did you do yesterday? I rode my bike. What did you do yesterday? I played soccer. What did you do yesterday? I had a bath. What did you do yesterday? I ate dinner. What did you do yesterday? I went to sleep. Okay, now we're gonna read them together, okay? So now just just let me turn the volume here. Okay, so the first what one did you is do yes what did you do yesterday? That's the question. Today I brushed I brushed my teeth. Now you what did you do yesterday? I brushed my teeth. What did you do? I yes brushed my teeth. I brushed teeth. Read the question. What, what did, did you do, you do yesterday? yesterday? 
I broke my teeth. Okay, very good. The next my teeth. What did you do yesterday? Hi, teacher. I ate breakfast. Okay, what did you do yesterday? I ate breakfast. What did you do yesterday? I ate breakfast. What did you do yesterday? I ate breakfast. Breakfast, breakfast. I ate breakfast. Very good. What did you do yesterday? I went to school. Okay. What, what did you do what yesterday? You do yesterday, I went to I school. Went to school. Went to Very school. good. What did you do yesterday? I what ate did... lunch. Okay. What did you do what yesterday? What did you do yesterday? I ate, I ate lunch. lunch. I ate lunch. Ate lunch. Very good. Lunch. What did you do yesterday? I read a book. The question? What, what did you do, did you do yesterday? yesterday? I read, I read, read a, book. a book. I read a book. I read. I read a book. I read a book. Yes, I remember read that this? Yes, that's correct. Remember that this is in the simple past. I read. I they, read. This bird is written yeah. in a similar way. In the present and in the past, it has the written, the similar written form. The difference is the pronunciation. For example, in present, it's read. And in past, read, the pronunciation. Read, present, read. Past. What did you do yesterday? I walked what did you the dog. What did, did you do? What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? I drank some water. Okay. What did you do? What, what did you do yesterday? I drank some water. I drank some water. I drank. Drunk. I drank. Drunk. Drunk. Yes. Drink. Mm -hmm. Present. Drunk. Past. Oh, okay. What did you do yesterday? I rode my bike. What did you do yesterday? I played soccer. What did you do yesterday? I had a bath. What did you do yesterday? I ate dinner. Gino. What did you do yesterday? I ate. I ate dinner. 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 Very good. Ate dinner. Ate. What did you do yesterday? I went what did you do? to sleep. What did you do yesterday? I went to sleep. Yeah. I went to sleep. I went to sleep. Very good. I okay. went to sleep. I went to sleep. Yes. Okay, now based on that uh, listening practice, we're going to continue with the next exercise. And this exercise is a, a written exercise that we're going to practice together. At the beginning, we're going to work together and then you're going to continue working with, with your partner or with your group. So, and it is about simple past tense. Okay. So we are studying simple past tense and we have the affirmative form. The affirmative is I, for example, oops, I read a book. Okay, I read a book. I drank water. I slept early. 
I went to the park. That is simple present affirmative. What about the negative? Didn't. So you use for the negative? <clears throat> Didn't. Didn't. Okay. And for the questions, you're going to use D. I'm going to explain you here. Just give me a second. I'm going to organize this here. Just give me a second. Here is this one. <clears throat> what is this one? Just give me a Let me see, it is here, the events, just let me see. <clears throat> I'm gonna use this one. I can use mm -hmm. I'm gonna use this one. I need these pictures here in my board. Okay, this is the exercise that I want you to please. Uh, pay attention just for a moment because we are going to practice simple past tense verse. So as we were saying here in the in the previous exercise, we have some positive statements. So and the positive statements, I don't know why it is this too small. Just give me a second. Okay. So the positive statement. We are talking about simple past tense. So the positive is for the first one. What is the past of drink? What is the past of drink? Drunk. 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 Okay. Drunk. I drunk. I drunk. Okay, yes, very good. So my positive statement is I drank water, like the example, right? Mm -hmm. I drank water. So the example number two, eat. Eight. 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 How do you spell eight? Eight. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. I ate my dinner. My dinner, okay, very good. Number three, huh? I have. I have. Okay. Oops, oops, oops. I have a car. I had a car. Okay. I make. What is the negative? Um, what is the past? May. 
I may my, my bed. Okay. That is the positive statements. All of these are positive statements. Now, what about the negatives? The negatives are these ones. No, so, I didn't. Yes, very good. Negative, I drink I water. Did. What is the negative? I, I, I didn't. I didn't. Very good. I drink. Drink. I drink. 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 Water. I didn't the drink. Classic. Water. Very good. Okay. Now, what's the second one? I didn't, I, number two. I, I didn't, didn't, I didn't, didn't have uh, no, it's it's my, dinner. my dinner, very good. The next one, I didn't, 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 didn't have, have, have a car, very good. The next one, I make, didn't, I didn't make, make my bed. Yes, very good. I didn't make make my bed very good okay so this is the positive and this is the negative way positive and negative let's see what about the question form what about the question i didn't i didn't see did. for example for the first one i drank i drank water what is the negative the question for i drank water did, did, I drink, did you drink water? Did you drink? 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 Very good. And the question mark. Okay. Question did you mark. drink water? Question number two. Eat. Let's did talk about eat, heat. You did, you eat, did, did you eat dinner? Okay, did very good. This eat. tense, very good. Because it's a boy, did he? Did he? Let's okay. use okay. a different pronoun. Did he eat, eat, eat my dinner? No. You, or his dinner? His dinner. Or his dinner. dinner. Yes, dinner. His dinner. Okay. Did he eat dinner? Ah, the question mark. Question number three. Did it's a boy? Did he? Did he have, have, have a car? A car. A car. Very good. Next question. Did he or she? He, 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 she he, she, he, she he, made. She made. Her bed. Bed. Make a her bed. bed. Very good. Did she make her bed? Okay. So that means that you have here the positive statement. With the positive, we use the verb in the simple past. Drank, ate, had, and made. For the negative, we need the this. Didn't. Didn't. I didn't. For example, you can write, she didn't. And it's the same, it doesn't change. Okay, she didn't. didn't. Or my possible. My friend, for example. My friend. Oops. My friend didn't have a car. So I didn't make my bed. Now the question. When you're using when you're talking about questions, you in the simple past, you need to use did. Okay? And this is the use of simple past tense. We did. Okay? Now, based on this, we are going to work in an exercise together. First, we're gonna do it together, and then you're gonna work it by yourself in your group. This one. And it is simple present affirmative, sorry, simple past affirmative, 
past simple negative and the question. And in the activity number one says, complete the sentences with one of the verbs in the box in the past simple. For example, washed, play, paint, stay, and visit. What's the simple pass of washed? Yes, it's one ED, right? Watch. 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 No, play. Mm -hmm. Paint. Paint. Okay. Play. 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 Played. Paint. Play. Played. Paint. 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 Visit simple past. Okay. Okay. So you're gonna Visit. use that here in the question in the sentences. Visit. You're gonna use the correct way of the simple past tense verbs. Then we can continue with the activity number two. It says you have to rewrite the sentences in past simple. Okay, in the negative way. Here says, I visited my friends. So you're gonna say, I didn't. Yes, I didn't visit, right? I didn't visit my friends yesterday. So you have here the positive and you write the negative in, the, in these sentences. And in the part number three, you're going to write the interrogative, the question form. For example, they visited their <coughs> friends yesterday. What's the question? Did they visit their friends yesterday? So you have the positive statement and you write the question. And when you finish, you click here on finish and share with the class your score. Okay, I'm gonna share with you here the link because we're gonna work with this in group of three. Let me see. I'm gonna share here in the in the chat of the group, and we're gonna work it together. Let me see. Right now we are twenty two pieces. Okay. No. Y Cher, si me explica nuevamente por qué me está sacando el sistema cada rato me tengo que meter y no le entendí que íbamos a hacer. Okay, no ¿viste? Ya, ya entra su grupo. Ahorita vamos a armar el grupo ya. Ya entra su grupo. Ahorita vamos a entrar a los salones, a los rooms. Ya entro yo a ayudarles. Go ahead, please. Get into the group. En Catherine, Mauricio, Fernando, Miguel, Naomi, get into the group, please. Okay. Viernes. Primero. Uh -huh. Primero Dios que ya se va a sentir mejor. Gracias, Ibis. Sí, con las medicinas también. Si le caen bien, pues no deje de tomarlas. Pero primero siempre más la fe en Dios, ¿verdad? Que le cuide, que sí, le cure. Es. 
y, y, y cuénteme, ¿será que solo yo veo que se me corta la, 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 la clase y escucho como cortado? ¿O solo soy yo? ¿Mi internet es malo? ¿O será que usted por No, ocasión está creo bien? que es internet, porque yo escucho bien. Tiche, Ah. una preguntita. Solo nosotras dos vamos a estar en la sala ahorita. Ah, tenemos a Edith, Ibis y Catherine. Y pero Catherine no, no, no Hola. dice. Hola, Catherine. Ah, ok, ok. Eh, ya tienen el link para poder. Yo lo tengo, digamos, abierto. Entonces me meto y le doy Ajá. que. Y ahí empezamos a completar. Clic derecho. A compartir. Uh -huh. Espérame. Bueno. Ya me agobió esta cosa otra vez. ¿Qué le doy, teacher, aquí? Aquí estoy en la página ya porque ya lo había abierto. Clic en el link. No, es que ya lo tengo. Ah, ah, entonces ahí por ahí, compartir. Lista, por donde está una carita de reacciones, dice compartir. Abajo. Espérame, es que hoy no me la da. Uh -huh. o sea, el icono de participantes, luego chatear, luego reacciones, y luego va la flechita para compartir. No, yo creo que me salí, espérame. Uh -huh. Como le decía, estaba corta, estaba, se cortaba mi internet. No le escuché a la teacher que era lo que íbamos a hacer. No, pero eso lo vamos a pasar, eso lo vamos a pasar como las oraciones al de este, pero el link no lo puedo, no lo puedo abrir. Me salí del link. Hola, Catherine. Catherine, hola, hola. ¿Usted me puede compartir? Este, y tienen el link, si quieren mándelo al chat para ver si puedo. Es que él va a creer que yo no puedo hacer eso. Ay, no me agobia todo esto a mí. Difícil. Ya está muerto. Vaya, screen dice ahora. Pero ¿a dónde tengo que irme? Aquí. Pero el chat, ¿dónde está? Es el detalle. Uh -huh. Tendría que salirme. ¿Qué le pasó a mis? No, dije, no pude. Espérame, ahorita. No lo tengo, dije. El que no tiene, mis. El, el, el abierto, el, el, el link. Y para regresarme. Vamos a ver, voy a intentar yo. Permítame. Ah. Ah, es Ahí está ya. Ahí está compartiendo okay. Catherine. Ok, Catherine. Bravo, Catherine. Le vimos toda la portada. Es terrible, Catherine. <risa> 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 Hoy sí, lo podemos ver. Uh -huh. Sí, ahí está bien, Caterina. Yo digo que sí está bien. Ajá. Ahí. Esperen. Mm. ¿Ahora? ¿La escucho? Sí, sí, la escuchamos. ¿Todo bien? Va, ya. Uh -huh. Vaya, entonces los de arriba hay que responderlo, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces los vamos a poner en, en modo simple. Espérenme. Calle. In the simple past, yes. Vaya. Uh -huh. Did she watch? to watch to be let's go
apply. All right. Ready. Uh, I read. I read. Home. Home. Ab. Home. Ab. 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 Ustedes vayan ayudándome a leer porque en vez de me, el acto corrector me escribe lo que no debe. Sí. Para escribir bien. Vamos, vamos. ¿Verdad? They. La otra. They. Uh, they. They. Play. Play football last week. Play, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Play football. Sí. Last week. 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 Yes, I to that song song last month. Ahí le falta la e en el song. La e, ¿verdad? Sí. Last month. Le que le digo que tengo que que leer bien porque monte ah falta bastante. ahora las preguntas verdad sí sí escondido uh -huh. acá está la la acá está como ahí está ¿no? sí did ajá did did uh -huh. bueno. Sería. Did, did, did she was? Did she was? Sí. She was. 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 Ajá, sería normal, ¿verdad? Sí. No, falta la C, ¿verdad? Uh, sí, la C H. Was. Did, did, did last weekend. Last weekend. Last weekend. 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 Uh -huh. uh, pero ahí le, le está faltando el signo de interrogación. Ok. ¿Verdad? Pues sí. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Lead. Did we are ready? Did they ever? Did we? No. Did we? We. Did we? No. Nosotros. Are you? ¿Cómo se pronuncia esa palabra? La, después de we. Arrive. Arrive. Solo escribe arrive. Arrive. Arrived. 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 Uh -huh. In the civil past is arrived. 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 Thank you. Arrived. Did, arrived. Did I eat did we? We, we uh, arrived. 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 Home. 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 At half. At half. At half. At half. 
past two. Past uh -huh. two. Past two. Uh -huh. I'm seeing that. Okay. Okay, four. The day. The day. The day. Play. The day. Play. 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 Play football. Last weekend. Last week. Last week. Last weekend. The two. No, it's solo week. Solo sería week. Uh huh. Week. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Week. Mm -hmm. The two. Did you listen? This this thing to the song to that song. Last month. Last last month. month. ¿Qué me le pasó a Ibis? Que me sacó Lig este, este sistema y, y cuando busqué a mi compañera y estaba queriéndole decir a Edith que cuando es en negativo y estaba queriéndole explicar y le digo yo aquí tengo yo una captura de cómo ella escribió el, en pasado y me sacó este el programa ya no pude meter. Bueno, ahorita la estoy ingresando. Con ellas mismas. Yes. Vale, gracias, Ticho. Ok. Ok, my friends, did you finish? Yes, Ticho. Oh, okay. yes, very good. Very good. So we are about to And hello, we are coming back to the principal room. Okay, now let's see. Pues okay. Ibis. Ibis, write your complete name, please. O se lo escribo yo aquí. Por si tiene uh, dificultad si ahí con él. Sí, es que pienso que aquí el teléfono medio lo toco y me saca. Así que no sé qué está pasando. Desde ayer me está dando esta, este problema. Lo tiene bien sensible. 
vayan Okay. que se van bien. Gracias. Okay, so now the next, uh, before we go to the next activity, we're gonna, I'm gonna watch, I'm gonna see here your attendance, Araceli Esmeralda, Carlos Arturo Olmedo, Araceli here, Carlos here, okay. Fátima Yesenia. Okay, Fernando de Jesús. Fernando, no. Ibi Jareli. Ok, Ibi, Joaquín Jesús Galán. Present teacher. Okay, Juan Antonio Villatoro. Present teacher. Good. Carla Susana Galeas. Catherine Rebeca, Lenin, Catherine, ok, Lenin, Naomi, Oscar Esaú, Jancy, or Jancy, no. Ok, so now we're going to check the practice, the last practice for today's class. That is this one. No, it was this one. Mm. It's here, let me see. We're going to practice... Fernando está diciendo presente en el chat. I thank you, Fernando. Thank you, Ibis. Ok. Fernando no, no. de Jesús Morales. Ok. Sí. Fernando de Jesús Morales. Y Naomi también. Naomi también. Ok. A mí ya me puso, ¿verdad, Tisha? Edith. Uh -huh. Yes. Gracias. Ok, ok. Okay, so the next activity is for you to practice pronunciation with this exercise. Que se me hizo. Ya se me fue por otro lado. Is this one? This one. Okay, we're going to check. Here, pronunciation. Yesterday, I played basketball. Last week, I kicked the ball. Last month, I waited for the train. All three words end in ED. But all three words have a different sound. Can you hear it? Played. What sound is that? That's right. Played has the D sound. Kicked. What sound is that? That's right. Kicked has the T sound. Waited. What sound is that? Waited has the ID id sound. We use the D sound for verbs that end in a voiced sound. Voiced sounds happen in your neck, in your throat. Verbs that end with R, L, M, G, V, S, Z, B, and M. Verbs like Entered, called, opened, damaged, loved, closed, amazed, described, named, all have the D sound. We use the T sound for verbs that end in a voiceless sound. Voiceless sounds don't happen in your throat, but in your mouth. Verbs that end in P, K, 
S F C X S H you can see it here. Verbs like stopped, liked, kissed, sniffed, danced, fixed, pushed, watched. All have the T sound. Oops, I guess that I'm gonna change that exercise because I cannot listen very well. I'm gonna use this one. I'd rather use this one. Mm -hmm. And this is the one. And I have here, let me see. Yes, miss, just give me a second. Este está mejor que el otro, porque el otro como que tenía como distorsión, no sé, la música de fondo mucho ruido. Or to book an online class. Visit ilearneasy.co.uk. Pronunciation of ED. In this video, we will learn how to pronounce the letters ED at the end of words. Words ending in ED can either make the id sound, d sound, or t sound. This depends on the final consonant in the root word. The letters ed make the id sound when the root words end with the letters d or t. For example, applauded, started, wanted, trusted, needed, toasted. Hated, painted. The letters ed make the d sound when the root word ends with the letters that are voiced. These include the letters g, l, n, r, s, w, y, v, z. For example, called, find cleaned, used, enjoyed, followed, loved, damaged. The letters ed make the t sound when the root words end with letters that aren't voiced. Usually they're whispered. These include the letters k, P, C, K, S, H, S, S, C, H, G, H, T, H, C, and X. For example, fixed, kicked, danced, washed, looked helped, laughed, watched. Oops, I was talking about. So I share already with you the link so that you can continue practicing at home, okay? Remember the pronunciation of the ED sound. Okay, let me see. And this one, this other one. Like this part. 
you have three ways. The id sound, the sound, and t sound. For example, here it says trusted, like this, trusted, wanted, needed, the cold, find, cleaned, used, used, enjoyed, followed, loved, with, fixed, kicked, danced, washed, looked. And this is the way you're going to continue practicing in your house, okay? And tomorrow we're going to continue practicing this. And by this moment, I want you to please open the link and start practicing. Okay, open the link and open your cameras. Okay, we're, we're going to practice for a moment. Go ahead. Practice for a moment. Open the link. Fatima, are you practicing? No. <laughs> Fatima is playing with the cat. No. <laughs> Le está esperando para ir a dormir. Sí, acá está <laughs> cuidando. Está, está bien chula. Okay, now let's check here if you practice. Let's check here together the exercise. It says the pronunciation. For example, in the first group, need. It is here, group number one, number two, or number three. Number two. Number, Number two. two. That is. Can you read it? Need it. Need yes. it. Need it. Very good. Now this one. Where this bird goes? Here, group number one, number two, or number three? Number three. Number three. 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 Number three. Leave it. Number one. Eight. Number one. Number one. Number one. Yes. Okay. What about this one? What's the group? Number one. Number one. One. Okay. Okay. Start. Number, number three. three. Okay. Number three. Then we're going to check. Arrive. Number one. Number one. Number. Okay. Number one. Number one? No. No. Number two. two. Number two. Ah, okay. Okay. Stop. What's the group for a stop? Number one. Number two. Okay. Number two, stop it. Okay. Huh? Stop it. Mm -mm. Number one. Okay, now. Want? Number one. Number one, number two, and number three. <laughs> okay, let's check here, maybe. Play. Two. Number one. 
Number one, okay, let's see. Oops, what a moment. Okay, next one. Look. Number two. Number two. Number two. Look it. Uh, oh yeah. Number looked Number three. Finished. Finished. Okay. And ended. Or end. Ended or end. Number three. Three. And number two. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. Like is no we, we can continue with that one. Okay. I'm gonna send you the link of this exercise so that you can complete the exercise. Because this you need to practice and practice and practice and continue practicing to master this. Okay, so we're going to stop it here and we're going to continue tomorrow with this class, Simple Past Tense. Okay, teacher. Okay, you can continue practicing, okay? Continue practicing this. See you tomorrow. Okay, see, Have see. a good night. See you tomorrow, teacher. Bye.